Hi, this is uh, Pugal from Rocket Realty. I'm a professional realtor serving Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas. In this video demonstration, I'm going to show you how, as a homeowner, you can file your homestead exemption form and save money on property taxes. Uh, this particular demonstration is aimed uh, for those residences living in Tarrant County. So the first thing you do, folks, is you go to this URL, www.tad.org. You don't have to write it down. I'm going to put all these URLs towards the end of the presentation. Now, once you go in there, you can click on Forms. And once you click on Forms, there are many forms Tarrant County has you need to search for a form that is specifically for you as a homeowner. So I'm going to pick homeowner. I'm going to scroll and you need to download this form that is for homestead or over 65 disabled person or disabled veteran. So I'm going to click on this and it is going to download this form. Now this is the form you're going to print and complete. Before doing this, you need uh, two pieces of information. One, along with this form, you need to send a supporting document. That supporting document is a proof that uh, on the driver's license, the current home that you're going to claim as a homestead should be there. Or if you don't have a driver's license, on the state-issued ID, you need to have the current the address on the state issued ID. You need to make a copy and you need to send along with this form. So if you have not done it, then you go to this URL and then you can do it online. And uh, you don't have to note down this URL. I'm going to include these links towards the end of the presentation. So now, once you have that done, um, this is where you will complete the completed application will be mailed. Um, then you need to complete all the homeowner information, the date, time, date of birth, and the email. Now they are specifically asking for two pieces of information, which is the account number and the legal description and the street address of the property. This is very easy to find uh, from uh, Tarrant County um, website. So let's go back to where we started. So you go back again to tad.org and you just enter your property address and search. When you enter the property address and search, it is going to pull out a document from where you can pull down the account number, the legal description, the street address and the deed filing information. So that's where you get all this information from. This is step number one. Now, as you scroll down, you're going to go into step number two, complete one of these boxes. Step number three, which is ownership information. Um, and again, carefully go and complete all these boxes or check these boxes wherever it is applicable, okay? See here, um, they are asking for a copy of the license. Um, <clears throat> that needs to be submitted um, along with this homestead exemption form. On step number four, there are types, different types of exemption you can claim. Um, a lot of people will check this box, which is going to be general resident homestead. Um, if you're 65 or older, you don't have to pay the ISD tax, which is independent school district. So you can check this box so you can you know, read each of these line items and if it is applicable, you can check one or more of these boxes, okay? Then in this particular step, if any of these boxes under the tax limitation exemption transfer is applicable, make sure you complete it. And once you complete, you can print this, sign it, and then send this form back to this address along with a copy of your driver's license showing the address 
or if you don't have a driver's license, you need to send a state-issued ID reflecting the address. Hope this was useful to you. If you want to see this and other useful videos, like us on facebook.com forward slash rocket realty or subscribe to our YouTube ch channel at tinyurl.com forward slash watch Pugo. Thank you.